Hi everybody, this is TT Readings and this reading is going to be for Cancer, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Mina Signs. Let's see what are the messages that pop out for you guys, Cancer. Check out the link in the description box, Cancer. It's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking, feeling about you, their next moves towards you? Outcome of the situation for you, advice, oracle messages, love notes. What does your person want to say a bit about your finances so do check it out okay also check out the link in the description box it's going to take you to your 2021 forecast so both of those links can be found in the description box below okay six of cups let's see what have we got for cancer What have we got for cancer? What have we got for cancer? You might have uh, walked away from something. Okay, let's see. What do we have for cancer? Yeah, I think you walked away from a situation because you felt like there was an equal uh, give and take. There was an equal reciprocation here. And then, you know, I think you had to make a choice here with the Two of Pentacles energy or you could still be making that choice because at times you tend to wonder about this past person, okay? But then you're like, no, I got to move forward. So there is a bit of confusion. This could be between two people as well, or it could be about, I don't know, what is it? There's some sort of a decision that I see you making. But I also feel like some of you are very ready for something new, okay? You found yourself after a long time and you're ready for what the universe has to bring you. So going with the flow of things, and getting your confidence back. That is something that I'm, I'm getting again and again. We have the Ten of Swords, the Temperance, and the Page of Pentacles, Energy Cancer. Again, um, I think more than that coming to an end, you just got tired of putting an effort into this. Okay? And you're not you're not putting any more effort. It, it, it almost looks like you've given up. And you're letting the universe do what it got to do. Okay? Whatever it is that you believe in. You know, you're like God or the universe. I don't know. Whatever it is that you say, you're like, okay, bring me what I want. I cannot be putting an effort anymore into this. All right. But you know what? I see you moving forward towards some sort of a new energy. And I see you very curious about, I don't know, it could be something related to your money, a money decision, a money decision, a financial decision, something about paperwork or something other than love, okay, that I see you deciding about, okay? Let's see. All right, the two of wands. Let's see. Page of Cups. Bottom of the deck, we have the Five of Wands energy, Scorpio. Scorpio, Cancer. I apologize. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. There's something that you look back at and you, you think it's nothing but a mess. I'm going to be very honest, okay? Um, now, I see love coming your way, and this is seeming to be somebody very keen to communicate with you, like somebody very um, interested in you, okay? This could be a new person as well, but this is seeming a very, um, what do I say, flirtatious energy, okay? This could be a new person. Um, I see you trying to move forward, actually. But from time to time, you do tend to think about a past situation that, that went wrong or, you know, there's an attachment to the past that lingers at times. Other than that, I see you moving forward. It almost looks like when you think logically, you're like, wait a second, I don't see the situation moving forward, right? So why am I dwelling on this? 
And then the other time you're like, oh, damn, you know, I wish things were better or this person at least gave me the closure, okay? I also feel like some of you are holding back from saying something to this person, so you're holding back from communicating. Um, you're trying to stay strong here, not contacting this person and trying to move on. Why? Because you want to be in a situation where there, where there is potential of growth, okay? Um, I just think that you know cancer. There's something that you just know. You just got to trust it, okay? And when you don't, it there tends to be a fear, okay? I don't know what is it that is holding you back. I see some sort of an unhealthy attachment, um, sadness, disappointment. And as much as you're moving forward, you're also looking back, okay? Whoever you're you're connecting with this person does look back okay they're also thinking about you thinking about communicating with you but i think you're gone you're gone um something became a mess due to somebody's lies or one person here was continuously putting in more effort than the other person was it almost became a very toxic situation that you're trying to let go of now okay i see you letting go very very strongly cancer but i also see changes happening in your life and i see a decision being made here i don't know what is it about to me it looks like something that has to do with your future okay it could be a decision about moving um a decision about investing somewhere i don't know a job related decision there is something that you're deciding about and it seems to be other than love okay something related to your future and you finally started to see the light at the end of the tunnel, cancer, so you do not want to be ruining, ruining it for yourself, right? But the only thing that tends to hold you back is your, um, I don't know, what should I say? It's not really a fear, but it's something from the past, okay, that tends to hold you back. Let's see. Let's see. The full energy. See? A new beginning. So with that full energy, I do see some sort of a new beginning, okay? We also have got the star and the moon, okay? So we've got a lot of major arcana here. It almost looks like you're trying to get over something, you know, seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. And I, I think there was something in the past that was really hurtful, okay? And it really brought you down emotionally, okay? I see lots of healing going on here and there is still a lot about a connection that's left unsaid, that's left undone, okay, closure issues and um, if you keep dwelling on something cancer, how are you going to recover and how are you going to heal your heart because I see your focus being on both, okay, I see your focus being on healing and I also see your focus being on but if this person told me the truth it would have been better what if you know and the more you dwell on that the more you dwell on what you okay this is how it is the more you dwell on what went wrong the more you're gonna find it hard to move on because there is a new beginning but you have to have that leap of faith as well to move towards it there is love coming your way. There's somebody coming your way. What is this Page of Cups? Because, see, we've got the Page of Cups, the Eight of Wands, the Knight of Swords. Somebody is coming towards you, okay? But I think this is not what you expect at all.
I see a new beginning. Okay. King of Cups and the Sun energy. So again, Cancer, I do see love coming your way. There's lots of happiness, um, forward movement, expansion. I do see a much better, you know, energy in the future for you. And I definitely see love coming your way. Okay. The signs that are here are Leo, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Aquarius, Pisces, Leo, Sagittarius. We have got lots of signs. Okay. Libra is here too, so let's see what we got for you, Cancer. Wow, a win-win outcome is forecast and then we have bring love into the situation. Check out the link in the description box, Cancer. It's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking, feeling about you, their next moves towards you, outcome of the situation between the two of you, advice, oracle messages, love notes, messages from the universe for you, okay? So do check it out. Also going to be linking your 2021 forecast, a time to give rather than take. Believe in the impossible and a new start is coming, absolutely. There's something new coming for you but there are new beginnings here and this is something i think with the believe in the impossible card it this is something that you don't see coming towards you and this is something you're not expecting okay but there's something new coming towards you a new beginning okay Getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost self to each other, your bond deepens. I see, okay, for some of you, you were stuck in a situation or the situation tends to hold you back because of children, okay? For others of you, you're trying to let it go. You're trying to let it go. And even if you have a child with this person, I see you letting go. You're not letting the situation confine you anymore. And again, with the attraction and the getting to know each other, I, I see somebody coming towards you, okay? I see you talking to somebody, having a conversation, all right? Look at that. There's somebody around you who finds you very attractive. That's why I said that there is that, you know, um, page of cups kind of energy towards coming towards you. So that's about it. Those were the energies that popped out for cancer. Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. Check out the link in the description box. It's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking, feeling about you, their next moves towards you, outcome of the situation, advice, oracle messages, love notes, as well as your 2021 forecast. So both of those links will be in the description box. Okay, take care and bye.